apologize and have just sent us home a show of strength. Welcome to Nantiva, I'm Oshi Banik, back with a new story. Amritsa, Navjot Singh Sethu, the newly appointed president of the Punjab Congress, Wednesday visited the Golden Temple along with scores of MLAs apparently backing him. There was much celebration among supporters gathered early in the day at his residence. At least one such MLA rejected a demand from Amarinder Singh's camp that the party chief apologize to Chief Minister publicly. After offering prayers at Sikh's holiest site, Mr. Sidhu and the MLAs planned to visit the cities Sri Valmiki Mandir, Ramthira, and Sri Durgyana Mandir. A luxury bus was seen entering the residential premises, likely to ferry them. An air of festivity lingered as people gathered at gates of Congress leaders' residence. Some played the traditional drums as policemen managed the crowd. The Punjab Congress Chiefs team said 62 MLAs had joined him. Why should Siddha apologize? It's not a public issue. The Chief Minister has not solved many issues. In that case, he should also apologize to the public. Parghat Singh, Congress MLA from Jalhandar Cantonment, said on reaching there. He was responding to a tweet by Punjab Chief Minister's advisor asking Siddhu to apologize. A public apology for attacking him on various issues was among the demands made by Mr. Singh's camp as a condition to agree to Mr. Siddhu's elevation as a state party chief. I have faith that 2022 Assembly polls will be won because of Mr. Siddhu. The CM's advisors are misleading him. Due to this, Punjab is going backwards, said Madan Lal Jalalpur, the Khanor MLA at Mr. Siddhu's residence. The cricketed town politician's appointment on Sunday, replacing Sunil Jhakar, came at the end of months long face off between the two and a series of meetings of state and national leaders of the party. Mr. Siddhu will take charge at 11 a.m. on Friday at Congress office in Chandigarh, according to Kuljit Singh Nagara, the working president of the state party unit. The appointment of Mr. Siddhu comes months ahead of state assembly polls, winning which was looking increasingly difficult for Congress amid such intense infighting.